Hello everyone, this is Donna and I'm so pleased to share with you um, my finished paper garland. I really loved the look of it and now it's hanging above my headboard and uh, it just goes so beautifully uh, with the um, colour scheme of my overcast and the pillows. Uh, isn't it beautiful? I am so pleased. It looks so um, opulent there, you know, it's so hard to tell what it's made of and uh, these are beautiful, these paper roses, gorgeous. And I couldn't have asked for a better head uh, piece than this. For years I've been wondering what to do with this piece because underneath the eaves and um, just want to brighten it up. I didn't want to have photos. I wanted something that was aesthetically pleasing. Um, and then I finally, uh, I wanted to make a paper wreath, but I'm so pleased that I made a garland instead because it fills up the space beautifully. And I've never seen paper garlands being made before. It was um, something I, um, came uh, I um, cooked up actually and I'm so pleased with the way uh, the shape and um, uh, how it looks because it's so pretty really pretty in fact I think it looks nicer than a wreath actually um, then I would love to show you how um, I added some extra details like these leaves underneath just peeking through and giving it an extra dimension and uh, texture you know very beautiful filigree like leaves and adds an extra color as well to the um, the um, rolled um, flowers paper flowers do you see that the color is just so uh, subtle and beautiful and it matches the silk ribbons that I've um, topped off the garland with. So I couldn't have asked for a better um, um, decoration for this um, space. And uh, this is actually a present that I've made for myself and I'm really, really, really pleased with it. You need to pamper yourself and uh, I really love it and I'm going to have a wonderful sleep tonight <laughs> with this hanging above me and actually I've got two ceramic angels and I'm toying with the idea of uh, that I made myself and I may add the two angels um, you know they've got these trumpets and I think they will fit beautifully I just don't want to overdo it so I'm waiting to see what happens and just want to share with you something else that I made oh um, this is a charm strand I don't know what you can call it but I've been sort of working on it on and off for a few months now you know I've seen um, people adding attaching silk ribbons you know silk um, strips rather and making something like this and um, I haven't got the slick silk uh, ribbons yet I may add it but um, I like the way it looks now as well so I've used um, Tim Holtz charms and starting from the top you know I've made uh, used wire to make this contraption and uh, this is a wooden thimble. It's not a metal one which I painted and I need to varnish it because I see the paint coming off. And then of course I've got some um, Tim Holtz charms hanging. Very beautiful and it reads, you know, faith, hope and that sort of thing. And it's lovely. It just goes... Uh, it's something, f you know, to inspire you looking at it every day then... I've got bead charms, I've got mother of pearl, I've got moonstone there, you know, so beautiful, these lovely stones. And then a metal postcard charm, you know, and then some Swarovski crystals there. Uh, just a plain um, charm there. 
and then some lovely metal tassels at the bottom. And um, I really love the look of it, you know. I may just hang it in my room so that I can look at, out, uh, look at it every day and just be grateful for my blessings. So my garland again, just wanted to show you a quick view of what, how it's looking outside. There you go. This is <laughs> all the snow that has fallen, you know, for the past two to three weeks here in Sweden. Let's see if I can back. This is the view from my bedroom window. Lots and lots of snow. I love this view when the sun shines, you know, you get a, such a beautiful uh, hue in the sky. And a pile up there. <laughs> so uh, with that, I'm going to leave you guys. Thank you so much for all your support this year. Wish you a Merry Christmas and um, all the best for the new year. Bye.